Hi, today we're going to be cutting the Midwest Products 1 8 inch uh, basswood or basswood. It has very similar properties to balsa wood used in hobbies, craft projects, RC planes and such. We have the 2.8 watt JTEC Photonics laser upgrade kit here and what we've done is focused it onto the top of the material. Make sure you go through the focusing procedure to get the finest point you possibly can. We're going to be running the laser at 1.5 amps. <clears throat> we have settings. We're just going to do a quick test here, so we're just going to do it in manual mode here to show you. We have it at 75 millimeters per minute for the feed rate. Always make sure you have everybody in the room have safety goggles on, and if you have shielding for your laser, that's always an extra plus. And here we go. We're going to start um, cutting the top and enable the laser. Do the first pass. It's not the fastest process, but it will cut through. 75 millimeters per minute. Not too shabby. I'm going to do the second pass the other direction. What I'm going to do is going to take the z-axis down just a little bit, a few tenths of a millimeter, and here it can go down, and we're going to go back the other way. That basically makes it so the focus can stay at the cutting surface, because now we're cutting through the material. Focus is the most important thing with cutting. You have to make sure that power density stays as small as possible in a tightly focused spot. Okay. I think we're good on that. Let's take the shielding off. And this thing should just fall right apart. And it sure did. There's a little bit of charring, but not too bad. You can see that it cut all the right through. Probably even it could go on a little bit faster, but you know, you can mess with your process at home and see how it works for you and when you're cutting your your uh, models or crafts or whatever you're doing. Okay, well, if you need more information, go check it out at jtechphotonics.com or laserbot.com. Thanks.